Well, welcome everybody to another episode of On The Road with Chris and today we're actually out in Lennoxville, Sherbrooke, just around the corner at Literacy in Action. And I'll tell you what, it's a beautiful day and here is the new entrance to Literacy in Action. And we're just around the corner from the main road in Lennoxville, so if you just head around the corner there, they're off the main track. Uh, obviously not on the main road where there's plenty of traffic and plenty of people going past, so hidden, hidden out the back here, but another beautiful day and uh, we're going to uh, go and enjoy our time with Literacy in Action, so come and follow me. We have our tea. It's tea time, everybody. Oh, you tea time. fantastic. <laughs> hey, Joanna. Oh, hey there. How are you going? <laughs> good Pretty good. You. Fantastic. We are excited to be here at LIA today. And uh, can you give us the grand tour of your location and your literacy center and show, show it off for us? Yes, I can. Oh. So, welcome to our new location. Beautiful. We moved here a couple of months ago, so we have some growing pains in terms of still figuring out where everything goes. But this is our multi-purpose room. So we have meetings in here. We do tutoring, private tutoring one-on-one, -on -one, um, whether if that's for reading, writing, or computer uh, literacy needs. Um, we do workshops in here as well. Um, so you might wanna see, we have a nice built-in fireplace. It's not lit up just now. Hello. And, um, and what's nice about this is that we, this, with our new location, we have some parking. Um, so right. for our volunteers to be able to make it and uh, right. and then um, yeah and so we have different resources with our books uh, this is a photo from one of our training workshops that we did um, right. we have uh, yeah some different resources for our tutors uh, when they're working with different community members um, as well as this is our this is very cool this is our reading nook um it's also a space for anybody to come to um if they just want to calm down if there's an activity going on in the other part of the room um they can come here and kind of uh hang out a bit to catch their breath um and inside we have we have books we yeah. got a little couch um and yeah Beautiful. so this is and this place actually was the old uh, Lennox, Lennoxville uh, bank, right? Like in, this is where we're standing in the safe, is that correct? This is the old safe uh, of the original bank in Lennoxville. So it's, uh, it's a heritage building, heritage site. All right. Um, one of the reasons we wanted to move was because we didn't have storage in the other space. So that's what oh. we're really excited about. I bet. Um, this is our kind of like our welcome area. We have our information board, like this is the things that are happening um, related to literacy, but then we also have some information for uh, with other things that are going on um, in the community. In fact, we even have some Literacy Quebec representation. Repin. <laughs> <laughs> And so if you'd like to follow me. Um, we would like to do so. Great. So again, a few more resources. 
We originally had an open space concept in our in our first spot, so that's why we have like a little bit of like bulkier furniture. So we found like different nooks um, for it. So yeah, and again, these are for tutors, different resources. We have a project called Help, which uh, is in collaboration with the hospital, where we work with um, practitioners um, who want to practice how to speak more effectively to their patients. Um, there's my office, yeah, which is busy, a busy total, office. total disaster. <laughs> but I'm one of those people that like to work in chaos. Um, I also like to think on a whiteboard or leave some notes Brilliant. there. Brilliant. Um, and we actually recently had a workshop with our Books to Belly animators. And we, we reviewed what their challenges were, how we could help, things like that. And then we looked at, on the other side, um, we, I did it through the each one teach one model that we do with Literacy in Action. This is our, the, for what they did, their success and what made it work. The reason it's on my wall is because I have to uh, transfer those into our notes and then make it look all pretty. Mm -hmm. um, so basically what I did was the way we use um, each one teach one with our, you know, for Literacy in Action and our, literacy, our sister literacy organizations, um, we used it within the model of our learners. So our project is regional. So we work in seven different communities uh, and none of the animators had met each other yet because they're like hours apart. Of course. And so we brought them all here uh, two weeks ago and they met each other for the first time and then they shared best practices and things like that. And it was really nice to kind of bring it all together. Very and nice. uh, yeah, because some had been doing it. They were part of the pilot three years ago and some are just getting their feet wet with the program. So ah. it was cool. Very cool. Yes. Uh, this is this is the original um, vault door. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> you mentioned that a lot of Lennoxville does keep its heritage buildings. We do our best. We do yeah. our best. So I know the landlord here definitely wanted to preserve it because I mean, how could you not? <laughs> Fantastic. So um, we'll skip the basement skip the for now. <laughs> That's we'll very important. Yeah, we'll go down there a little bit later. <laughs> Because we have, it's exciting, our storage space. Mm -hmm. I don't know, it might seem like trash to others, but I'm so pumped about it. This is um, J.O. and Joe. Hello. 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 Our team. So J.O. does our communications and publicity, and Yo is one of our community animators mm -hmm. and project coordinators. Excellent. Yeah. yeah. Again, the magic happens. Yes. <laughs> and so, <laughs> then we have Carol. Hello, Carol. <laughs> Welcome nice to the kitchen. <laughs> I know. Nice. I'm eating in the kitchen. Yes. Of course, this is where you're supposed to be. Good afternoon. Okay. Coffee. Beautiful. So this is this is kind of like your drop in Tuesdays area as well where Exactly. So we you just caught us during our tea time, so we haven't moved all of our stuff yet. But um yeah, so Tuesday we do a drop in here in Lennoxville mm -hmm. and the idea is like we just want to invite people to come in um, and check out the new space because we realize that um, at the end of the day a lot of people need an invitation mm -hmm. in order to show up. Sometimes if we just say open hours, they're, le they're, they're like, oh, that's when they're working. Yeah, so course. drop in is kind of our experiment yeah, to yeah. see if we change the language around the open hour for Fantastic. them to come in. Fantastic. Um, and because and has it's, it has, has it's, 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 yes. Yeah, good. It is All working. Right. Um, so one of the things we've been doing with that is, um, let's go, we'll go back to a more sure. convivial space. But one of the things that uh, we do is we do, we have a computer uh, literacy tutor on site okay. here. So if somebody wants to come in for help with their computer or whatever computer, they can come get help with their computer and then they can just kind of hang out if they want to. And so it creates a purpose for mm. them to come, check out the space, find out what else is happening, what other events, Absolutely. Uh, or they can just come for coffee or tea and uh, hang out and get to know us. Um, and yeah, it's been, it's actually like pleasantly surprising that oh, it's yeah. working. <laughs>